So, let me brief you guys up with a little bit of American History 101. In the 1930s, there was a slight economic depression in America. Unemployment only rose like 30%. And it wasn't all that bad, right? Just people overreacted and whatnot. <sighs> yes, it was terrible. So, America was all like, guys, we have to come up for a way for people to spend money. The industries were all like, yo, people, please buy our stuff. So the designers were like, guys, we got you covered, man, we got this. So the designers created what we call the Streamline Modern, or the American Streamline. This was a reaction to the Art Deco and the reflection of the Austrian economic times. In other words, instead of focusing on the function, they just focus on the shape. Sharp angles were replaced for simple, more aerodynamic curves. Exotic woods and stones were replaced with cement and glass, and the use of steel and chrome plate items were introduced. The mastermind behind all of this was our dear friend Raymond Louis, with his famous quote, The most beautiful curve is a rising graph. Born in Paris, 1893, he always had a passion for modeled aircrafts, and this passion took him for a ride. After serving the French army for World War I, he went to New York and worked as a window designer. He worked in multiple places, but what we should really be talking about is his design. Slowly building up fame, he went to design other adequates for the United States. So, one of his primary things to design was, well, you guys all smoked, right? Or you guys smoked before. And you guys, have you guys ever seen Lucky Stripe Packs? Yeah, that was him. He designed the logo. This logo was essentially the concept for all the other cigarette logos to base themselves off of. Another thing he designed was the Shell Company logo. Shell was made by him. Okay, I mean, yes, you can say that the logo has changed throughout history, but it's only been improved from the original design. And talking about design, why not talk about cars? Yo, Stu Baker was a company car that not only did he make the logo for them, he also designed these cars, these, these aerodynamic, chrome-shaped deluxe vehicle of exotic extravaganza. 